Good morning, guys. Welcome to today's video. Meet Chipmunk. And who is this? Scarlet. Scarlet. Don't don't pick my egg. <laughs> we sometimes. Whoa, we sometimes get eggs. I swear, chickens are so trainable. All right, we can give it to them because she just is working so hard to get it. And that's my little chicken. Oh, that's my ring. Oh, don't, I don't like them to peck it open because I don't want them to learn. Ah, I do suck. Ah, how do you do it, Sophie? Don't let them do it. Well <laughs> you suck too. Well done, I got <laughs> she is so cute. <laughs> hold on, hold on, I got this. Clearly our chickens. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Oh, <laughs> I got it. <laughs> you know it's fall when the grasshoppers are huge, you guys. The grasshoppers are just flying around like crazy. It's fall and I love it. It's a long weekend in Ontario and I swear the long weekend in May is always freezing cold and the long weekend in September is always so hot. And it is in fact super hot today. But in regular day by day fashion, the girls are dressed for winter. They're just getting ready to come down and help do some chores in the barn. We have all these same pitchforks. Do you guys see them? These three are the same. That one has is our oldest one and it's broken. And then this one is my favorite. And this I think is the newest one. So basically the reason this is my favorite is because it has a smaller handle. See this, the handles? That one has like a heavier wooden handle and I like the skinny one. Anyway, welcome to today's video always happens to me. Welcome to today's video where Laura whacks herself in the head <laughs> and almost again. Holy heck. You guys try doing things with one hand. Move. <laughs> Move, pony. It's actually quite late in the day. The horses have all been out most of the day already. They're in for the heat of the afternoon and we are hopefully going to hang out with friends. We have plans with our friends today. Uh, we're just waiting to see what their schedule looks like and then we're gonna figure it out. It is the last long weekend of summer. I want to do at least one fun thing with the girls today or this weekend to end the summer. I feel like when you have horses and you show horses, you spend so much of your time preparing and showing and riding and practicing and it's important to take time out and away from that to kind of lead a more balanced life. And sometimes we do that. And soon we will be back to a school and days that we do school, I don't know if you guys remember from last year, but when we do school, it changes our whole entire vlogging dynamic. And that's what I love about life. I love change and different things. And sometimes if we do like too much of the same thing, I start to get restless and feeling like I need to make a change. And I kind of feel like I need to make a change right now. But anyway, it is the last week of summer, last weekend of summer, and we're gonna plan to do something so super fun with the girls, so we'll take you guys with us. But first, chores, you guys. When you have horses, first chores. How are you feeling, sister? I feel much better. You feel much better? How's your face? Uh, my face still hurts a little bit when I like go like that. That's because like, I don't know. Yeah, so what, I don't even know exactly what happened. When you fell, I was looking at Kate. Kate came into the arena. Um, did he spook? No. He didn't spook? He tripped. Oh, I didn't know he tripped. Oh, that makes more sense because Denver is not a spooker. <laughs> He's not, I've never seen him spook in the light. Yeah, I've never seen him spook before either. Oh, so he tripped, what did he trip over? Just his feet? Probably. Oh, well anyways. I mean, I trip over my feet too. Yeah. It, it's, it's normal. So he tripped and then you just flew over his head? Yeah. Be were you holding on? No. Lesson learned, right? Yeah. Hold on in case horses trip. I still won't hold on. <laughs> Are you going to ride again? Yeah. Yeah, that's good. I'm I just don't hold on. 
Well, no, no, I don't hold on. Well, this was serious, Sophie. You have to hold on. Like, if I mean, you normally don't land on my head, so. I know, but you actually have to hold on. I looked over and he was like, he was going up. Like he was, he was like riding himself, like bringing himself back. I don't, I don't even know. Like when you see something like that, your kid falling. I saw her falling. I just happened to, I heard a commotion, looked over. I thought he spooked, but anyways, I guess he tripped. When you see something like that though, when you're watching your kid, you, it really affects you. Like Sam and I both, like it's like a trauma to your, to your brain. Like you can't focus, adrenaline gets pumping and you can't like figure out what you're thinking because you can't even figure out what you're seeing because you just are in such shock. But a young girl on Snapchat sent me pictures of all of her friends or a bunch of people uh, falling in the month of August. And she said, you know, everybody's falling and my other friend just fell too today. <laughs> Like, what the heck though? It seems like August is just the falling month, but the truth is, is that horses are horses and sometimes they trip, sometimes they spook, sometimes they spook, sometimes they trip, but it does make sense to me. Like there are no spooky horses at our lesson barn, which is actually amazing. And our horses aren't spooky either. Are any of our horses spooky? No. No, that's crazy. That is crazy. Oh yeah, Chino doesn't like wagon rides. <laughs> if you saw our video the other day, Chino was looking at that wagon ride like he was ready to run. And at one point I think he did run, but luckily for us, there are no spooky horses that are less in barn. So this fall, my big project is to clean out our barn. It got like, because we have like our jumps and stuff in here, like we have no room. Is Toby the Toad here? Toby the toad, do you see the toad? No. It kind of got taken over and then Sam like had a bunch of stuff in his truck and it t got taken over. But this fall, one of our big projects is to clean over the barn again. And I also want to make a video of all of our saddle pads because a girl on TikTok challenged us to show all of our saddle pads because she watches somebody on TikTok who has a ton of them. We have more over here. We have more here, but we also have a ton at the barn, right? Gabby has more than me at the barn. Yeah, how many do you have at the barn? Like three or four. Essentially, we have saddle pads everywhere, but I'm going to make a video showcasing our amazing saddle pads. Actually, five. What if, like, when our girls grow up, we have somebody make a quilt out of all of our saddle pads? Wouldn't that be, like, so cool? Somebody suggested, suggested that to me, but out of all of our saddle pads, we could probably make two quilts. That would ruin our saddle pads. I mean like one day when we're not riding as much and stuff. Like this is your childhood. This is like such an important memory. That would be a very comfortable blanket. It'd be so heavy though. And they would add extra material. It would just be like, I love the idea. Anyway, they're getting all dusty. I need to figure out a better way for that too. It looks way better. You look way better. From farther away, it it looks like you got punched in the face. <laughs> yeah. The ground punched in your face, guys. <laughs> yeah, I don't even know. And in the nose. How it happened. Like, it's just bizarre. But anyway, she's doing so skater. much better. And she's not going to be riding for a little while. I don't even know if what we plan to do tonight, if she'll be able to do it. We're going to try it and see. If she can't handle it, she'll have to go with Sam and leave. And, but she's feeling much better. Her headache is gone. So we're gonna try and step to the next level, step to day two and see if she can do a little bit more today. All right, we are all in the car. I actually, so we My made plans with friends you guys. and I gave them a choice. I gave them a choice. Do you wanna go on a trail ride? The Pasofinos? Wait, when did you give us this choice? <laughs> I gave uh, the choice to the other people and this is what they chose. <laughs> Get up there. We're good to go. Sophie, I think you're taller than Gabby now. No. You're past it too. So am I good? We're on like the same. Yeah, you guys are like the same height. So Sophie's gonna take it easy. We don't we don't know, like we didn't know if she'd be able to handle the noise of it, but she's handling the noise well. We got her a bracelet in case we find something like that's easy that she could do. Yeah, but these no, no, oh my gosh, this is how, this is how the equestrians roll, they go on the little trucks, I don't, 
if there were horses, then we would eat. All right, go ahead. All right, if they say, why are your kids going on the baby monster truck, they'll say, do you want to go to the zoo? No, we don't eat. Sure. I'll say we're not a risky family. Julia, be careful with my child. Don't drive her into anything. Hey, I am there, too. I control the back wheels. Huh? Have you guys noticed that the bar and boots girls are the drivers? This is not embarrassing at all. So boring? Yeah, so boring. Well, that's the only speed you're going today, sister. We're going on the B1 now. All right. <laughs> Regret nothing. <laughs> yeah. My knees didn't fit. I was like sitting like this. Light bum high. <laughs> <laughs> Holy heck! Can we go to the bees? All right, let's go to the bees. And the hoodies come off. You know it's hot when. So, so far she's been doing really good today, right? Yeah. It is time for the ride of the night. What do you say? Keep your hands inside? Hands and arms like in the ride. What are you doing? What's on top of I got Julia as my partner. Yeah. I heard a creak. I heard a creak. I hear the sound. Whoa. This is kind of scary. Don't worry. Don't worry. Haley has a video of me feeding the ball. <laughs> Let's see if we can see Sophie. Oh, they're high. I can't see anything. Don't lean forward! <laughs> Don't move! <laughs> no! No! <laughs> Sit back and relax. I remember it being a lot more fun, but look at look at the view. This no, is not the I best view. This being we got like the track. Fun. One side. Chopper's drug mart. And then we got Chopper's drug mart we on the other side. We got a guy walking his dog. We got a guy walking his dog. Oh, yeah, a cute dog. Oh, wait, it's a girl. Woo! <laughs> <laughs>
Sophie's been playing games and she went a sloth and it's a, a snake. snake. <laughs> it's a belt for the sloth. those darts she's got. Woo! I mean there's not my there's look at those two pink ones on the bottom. Woo! Let's get two together. Woo! Oh. to just run off and be kids and be teenagers yeah, me and, and Julie kept running off. yeah Sylvia and Julia just kept running off and being crazy and Gabby and Kate I we hardly saw them they rode the rides till they couldn't ride the rides anymore and Julia mostly kept to the one yeah it was so fun it was so much fun so we got a snow cone and Gabby got some ice cream and we are headed home now to go to bed because it is so late so the vlog is gonna be up a little bit late if you're wondering why it's because we got home so late but I'm gonna get up early and I'll edit first thing in the morning. We'll see you guys tomorrow. I hope you guys all are having an awesome weekend. Don't you know that you